everyone, it's Lena Mega Panay and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing another bro test review for a liquid lipstick and this is from Everbelena and it's called the Everbelena Liquid Lipsticks. So if you guys are interested to know what my thoughts and initial verdict about this product, then just keep watching. So as mentioned, gagawa natin ng review itong mga bagong liquid lipsticks na binili ko from Everbelena. These are creamy liquid lipsticks that actually has a matte finish. This retails for 185 pesos. Um, for a small tube, I think medyo mahal siya. I don't honestly understand bakit ito na parang maliit lang yung container tapos yung kanyang I don't know if you guys can see yung design ng container niya guys is sort of like in a lipstick um, shape so hindi niya talaga totally na occupy yung buong tube so hmm that's a little suspicious for me so going back I only have six shades nitong smaller tube na to and dalawa lang yung nakuha ko actually dalawa lang yung nagustuhan ko um, but if you guys are interested ko any mga shades na available para sa line na to I will put the link down in the info box so you can check it out but itong dalawang shade na to is yung Talia which is the red shade tapos yung Serena which is mauvey pinky kind of shade maybe mas magandang gawan ko ng review itong product na to using the red shade so yun yung gagawin natin ngayon pero I'll do a quick swatch ng lang dalawa go so the red one is Talia and the other one is Serena definitely Serena is something that you can wear on a daily basis red masyado si parang ano a dark darkish reddish si Talia, but still wearable I would say and as you guys can see it doesn't look matte it's more of like a sheery kind of finish so without further ado let's go ahead and apply this on my lips I will kind of zoom you guys in para makita yung application process but as you guys can see I have nothing on my lips um, I did put some lip balm kanina prior to having my makeup on and then I put a little bit of the foundation around the perimeters of my lips 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 para naman ma cancel out niya yung aking lip color basta yung basta yun na yun gets you na okay so without further ado let me go ahead and apply this on my lips Alright, so there you go. This is how it looks on my lips. I didn't really expect na ganito ka vibrant yung red niya. O yung pinaka color niya on my lips. Iba yung shade niya dito sa swatch na ginawa natin. Um, parang feeling ko medyo may pagka push out, push out pa yung red. But I think medyo na layered out ko siya. Kaya naging mas vibrant siya. So that means you can obviously put more layers to make it more opaque um, but I don't feel na it's setting into like a matte finish it feels really nice it doesn't feel dry on the lips it's really creamy actually tapos meron pa akong mga dry patches sa lips ko ngayon which is good kasi I can definitely tell or test itong liquid lipstick na to pagdating sa mga dry patches sa lips but overall, it's very, very comfortable. I mean, the feeling of liquid lipsticks, or lipstick rather. But I'm not really that confident by the more red liquid lipsticks or red lipsticks in any way. Um, but yeah, ipo push natin to since sandito lang naman tayo sa bahay. Pwede pwede tayo mag red lipsticks. Walang po kontra. But so far, hindi pa siya nagsiset, guys. I still feel na medyo malakit pa siya sa lips. So I would say na hindi pa siya 100% like set. And uh, I like it. It looks matte from afar to be honest, pero pag sa pakiramdam medyo hindi pa. Pero there's no tackiness on the lips. I will give it a few more minutes para mag completely set siya sa lips. Uh probably like 5 to 10 minutes din natin kung may difference ba. 
All right, so it's been five minutes and I don't think nagset na siya sa lips ko, but I'll do a quick transfer kiss proof test para makita natin yung itsura ng lips if may transfer ba siya or wala. Go. Obviously, meron pa dito sa mga corners, ayan, tapos sa gitna, medyo may slight transfer siya. Ooh, that's a phone call. Alright, so with that note, I would say na hindi siya 100% kiss proof, pero I'm impressed kasi kahit paano, hindi talaga siya nag-transfer ng sobra-sobra. So, I would say na kung talagang konti lang yung na-apply ko sa liquid lipstick na to or sa lips ko, most likely magiging um, mabilis yung pag-set niya sa lips. Anyways, I definitely feel na lightweight siya sa lips. Hindi mo talaga ramdam na meron kang something sa lips. Hindi siya malagkit, hindi siya tacky, hindi siya nakakairita sa lips. So, that's a really good thing. And it's very creamy. Hindi niya na-emphasize yung mga dry patches ng lips ko, which is good. And also, the color payoff is amazing. So, I'm, I'm happy with this as of this time. But, we will see kung long wearing ba to. I will be wearing this throughout the day and see how longevity-wise this product can offer. So, yeah. Anong oras na nga ba? Ang oras natin ngayon, it's 10.38 ng umaga. I will catch you guys in a few hours and share with you guys ano yung itsura niya from time to time. So, I'll catch you guys in a bit. Okay, you guys. It's been like parang mga 20 minutes na ata since inapply natin si liquid lipstick. So, I feel gusto ko talaga lang ising itong video na to kasi gusto ko pakita sa inyo ano yung na-discover ko, guys. Look. almost 100% na siya na talagang kiss proof. As in, talagang kumapit na siya sa lips ko. And that's amazing. Actually, kanina na surprise ako wala talaga eh. Ayan. Pero hindi pa ako umiinom ng water niyan. So, that's a good sign. This is looking really promising for me. So, yan. Quick update lang yan, guys. looks like after lunch. Okay, after the apple. Hi, you guys. So this is going to be my first official check-in, I guess. It's already 6.20. Wala lang akong hawak na watch. Pero 6.20 na, guys. And I think it has been like more than six hours. Okay, mm. balik natin. It's more than six hours since inaplay natin si liquid lipstick kanina ng umaga. And marami na siyang napagdaanan throughout sa maghapon. Um, and so far, ito na yung itsura niya. And when it comes to its opaqueness, yung kulay, yung vibrance ng kulay, guys, wala akong masabi. Kasi obviously, from what you guys can see, Okay na okay pa rin yung opaqueness ng kulay. Pero hindi ko ikaiila. Tama ba? Hindi ko ikakaila pala. Na yung inner rim area niya. Ayan, yung sa pinakaloob. Um, faded na siya. If not, wala na. Um, I don't know. I guess I would say na depende siya sa kulay ng liquid lipstick na gagamitin mo. But for this case, hindi siya ganun kasagwang tingnan. I do see na na-emphasize na ngayon yung mga dry patches. I don't know kung nakikita. Ayan. Yan yung mga dry patches dun sa lower lips ko. And it's starting to be very much obvious. Pero, as of this moment, I would have to say na okay siya. Hello, hello, and this is gonna be my final check-in for this liquid lipstick na nire-review natin for today. Ang oras, it's 8.12 in the evening, so it's around 10 hours na actually since in-apply natin itong liquid lipstick kaninang umaga, and eto na siya guys. And 
obviously nakita nyo na, naman sa mga previous clips bago nyo to na reach marami na pinagdaanan tong liquid lipstick na to and I actually just finished my dinner before I go further into the details I'll zoom you guys in slightly para makita nyo kung ano niya after 10 hours okay so obviously yung ating inner corners dito sa pinaka sulok ng ating mga lobby wala na siya and very patchy na sorry may sipon pa rin ako ngayon uh, very patchy na yung itsura niya all throughout the lips uh, mainly ang natira na lang sa kanya is yung pinaka parang outer perimeters ng lips ko the rest especially dun sa inner area yung inner perimeters yung madalas nababasa ng laway faded na siya if not as in, wala na. Sabi ko nga, kanina masyadong maraming pinagdaanan tong liquid lipstick na to ngayon. Pero, andyan pa rin siya sa lips ko. It's not something na, I would say, pleasant. Pero, from afar, kita mo pa rin yung aking lip color. Of course, it will vary kung anong shade yung kukunin nyo. Baka sakaling kung itong si Serena ang ginamit nyo, eh baka hindi nyo na siya makita. Ngayon, I would like to highlight all the things that I like about this product and then I will also highlight ko all yung mga hindi ko nagustuhan. So let's start with the price. Of course, it's 185 pesos. I would say it's affordable. Also, to think na available siya kahit saan, di ba? You can go sa supermarket, grocery, even Mercury Drug. I think meron silang Everpelena. Now, when it comes to its performance, I would say... First of all, it's very, very creamy on the lips. Tapos, it's very lightweight in the lips. Hindi mo ramdam na meron kang liquid lipstick or anything on your lips at all. Very comfortable siya na suotin throughout the day. I also like the fact na hindi niya na-emphasize yung dry patches ko dito sa aking lower lips. And hindi nag-settle yung liquid lipsticks doon sa mismong dry area. Pagdating naman sa opacity, mukhang okay naman siya sa akin. But then again, depende pa rin siya sa kulay na kukunin mo. So, on this test, itong si Thalia, very opaque siya para sa akin. Yung kulay niya, guys, hindi masagwang tingnan para sa kulay or sa skin tone na meron ako. Now, as for its longevity, um, I would definitely say it's long-lasting. It's long-wearing. Give it around 6 to 7 hours. I think that's the maximum na pwede mong masabi na talagang long wearing to consider the fact na depende siya sa kung anong kakainin mo. Now, one of the things that I think is disadvantage itong liquid lipstick na to, it only has six shades. And lahat ng shades na guys, I would say nasa bold colors. Another thing is super tagal niyang mag-set sa lips. Lalo na kung ikaw ay nagmamadali, girl, hindi ka ata tatagal sa pag-iintay dito kasi as per my experience, ha, umabot siya ng around 20 minutes to 30 minutes. So before I share my verdict, I would like to test kung magkakaroon ng tackiness ba dito sa lips kapag i -re reapply natin sa product. So yun yung gagawin ko ngayon. Okay, there we go. So far, wala akong nararamdaman na tackiness sa kanya. Still very creamy. Still hindi niya na-emphasize yung aking dry patches dito sa aking lower lips. Which is amazing. So, having said all those things, guys, do I recommend you guys trying this product out? Definitely, yes. It's a two thumbs up for me, guys. Uh, but this true in particular, okay sa akin tong dalawang shade na to, guys. Try nyo to, guys. Hindi kayo magsisise. So, I guess that's it for this review. If you guys have any questions about the product, let me know in the comment section below and we'll try to address them as much as I can. All the product information that I can gather related to the product will also be listed in the info box, so make sure to check it out. And if you like these kinds of videos, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. But as always, thank you so much for watching everybody and I hope to see you on my next video. Bye!